With season 12 of the sci-fi comedy cartoon all wrapped up and a confirmed seasons 13 and 14 of Futurama waiting in the wings, we here at Screen Rant are thinking about the baddies that didn't make the cut this season and who the show should definitely bring back to the screen. So, let's take a look at three villains from past seasons who would add some spice to the latest episodes. Neither do nerds! Brett Blob, seasons 3, 4, and 6. The son of H.G. and Mrs. Blob and the bully that terrorized Hubert Farnsworth and Dwight Conrad. He featured a few times in the early seasons. The Blob family in general are known to be less than impressed by the Farnsworths, with Brett's dad also seemingly out to get the professor. He provided some comic relief in the same way Nelson Muntz from The Simpsons does. <laughs> Angry, oversized, and not so smart, with the added nod to stereotypical 1950s style movie bullies in his red Letterman sports jacket, singling him out as one of the jocks, the ultimate nemesis of the nerd. Na 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 na, na 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 na. The scammer aliens, Bender's big score. Neuter, Fleb, and Schlump are the notorious time-traveling nude con artists. Throughout Bender's feature movie, they were responsible for one of the most chaotic periods in Planet Express history. Their obsession with scamming for profit and complete disregard for morality make them ideal recurring villains. With the complexity of their time travel abilities, there are countless ways they could return in season 13. Perhaps they launch a new scam targeting the future of technology or financial systems in New New York. The show has always been excellent at mixing sci-fi with societal issues and with modern themes like cryptocurrency and AI fraud on the rise, the scammers could fit right into that narrative. Their return could also offer an opportunity for more hijinks through time, which is always a fun element for Futurama fans. These are all rusted out with snitch juice. The Robot Mafia seasons two, three, four, six, seven, and 11. These mechanical mobsters led by Donbot have appeared in multiple seasons throughout the years and even a couple of the movies. They did briefly appear in season 11, production season eight, but it's always good to see them bust back onto the scene. The Robot Mafia offers plenty of comic relief with their classic gangster stereotypes, but they could easily be pushed into a more central threatening role. With the popularity of the new Penguin series, there is definitely opportunity for a storyline that satirizes it. Not to mention, their interactions with other villains could create some hilarious alliances or betrayals. It could also provide some Bender-centric episodes. With his criminal tendencies, he's always an easy target for the Robot Mafia's schemes. The Robot Mafia's blend of humor, danger, and nostalgia makes them perfect for a season 13 return. Conclusion Brett Blob, the Scammer Aliens, and the Robot Mafia all bring unique opportunities for Futurama season 13. Whether it's personal rivalries, complex time travel scams, or classic mafia antics, these characters could easily bring entertaining and engaging storylines while tapping into the rich history of Futurama. Thanks for watching Screen Rant. See you next time.